the last thing we need to learn to create our basic model of our building in Revit is a curtain wall. Uh, what is a curtain wall? A uh, curtain wall is a wall with glazing and in Revit it placed in a just wall architectural in the bottom there is three types of curtain wall. Just curtain wall, it's the first type. The second one, exterior glazing. And store front. Let's look. The difference just in properties. So, uh, curtain wall, it's a system family like basic wall and uh, like stacked wall and this is a wall type which uh, allow us add some uh, uh, enter a grid and add malleons to parts of our wall so it's look uh, like these walls. First, uh, uh, system. Uh, first type of wall. It's a curtain wall. It's wall without uh, any pattern. The second one type. It's an. Uh, the second one, exterior glazing, has a pattern, but has no malleons. And the last one has pattern and malleons. So uh, now, on the three oh, you can select your wall on a three-dimensional view or, or on a plan or any view. Now I can select my wall because I'm I hide a wall category, so I reset temporary height is a late. And now I can select entire wall. So uh, really, when you uh, place your wall with pattern, uh, Revit adds a panels in your wall. And if you want to, uh, Revit can add a malleons also into your wall. So uh, the main workflow is the same as your uh, just basic wall. You can pick your wall, you can define it high and uh, I create a wall a little higher like that. Here it is. And in the properties you can set justification, beginning, end or center and you can uh, enter an angle to rotate for example like this and enter an offset if you want to. So uh, in the next video we need to learn how we can and create a custom uh, glazed wall.